The new Celebri release brings a variety of different functionalities and fixes. Let us guide you through a couple of them. In this release, we introduce a new Simple Floor Selection tool. With a Simple Floor Selection tool, it is easy and fast to view a single floor without having to jump back and forth in the selection basket. The Show or Hide Floor Selection tool is located in the 3D toolbar, giving users an easy way to view single or multiple federated floors in the 3D view. The Show All button works the same as before, and once pressed, all the floors are visualized and active under the Floor Selection tool. Next, in this video, we will show you your Celebri Dimension tool and some improvements we have made to it in the latest release. To take a dimension in Celebri, first choose the Dimension tool from the toolbar. Simply click on a place where you want to take the dimension from and choose where to end that dimension. The dimension gets drawn in the 3D view. To get more options on how the dimension is drawn, right click in the 3D view and tick the Show Dimension options. Now after taking a dimension, a dialog will pop up which will give you options on how the dimension should be taken. You can also use the short keys when using the dimension tool. By pressing the control key by taking the measure, the dimension will be locked to the component so you will get the latest and shortest distance between the components. This is especially handy when you are taking the dimension from rounded objects. Like shown before, this is also possible to do after changing the dimension from the dimension tool options. In the previous versions, sometimes you would find the dimension being blocked by some components in front of the drawn dimension. This has now been improved in the latest Celebri release, with the new setting that allows you to display the dimensions in front of components. In this way the dimensions will always be easily visualised. Contact your Celebri administrator to get the new version today.